In today's video, we are going to talk about what you should do if plastic is stuck to metal. This is a very common and annoying issue. Plastic can melt and get stuck to your knives, pipes, tools, or even metal rods. Luckily, we have three different methods you can use to deal with this. For example, we will use ice to remove plastic from a small metal pipe, petroleum jelly to remove plastic from a knife, and a paper cutter to remove plastic from a large piece of iron. First, let's use ice to remove melted plastic off of a metal pipe. This is one of the easiest ways to get rid of plastic from metal, as all you need for it is ice in a large bowl. Place lots of ice cubes into the large bowl and put the metal pipe inside. Use your hands to move the ice around so that the pipe is completely covered by it. Let it stay inside the ice for some time. Then, you can take the pipe out to clean it up. As you can see, staying in the ice will loosen the plastic's grip, and you will be able to easily take it off with your own hands. Next, we will show you how you can easily remove plastic from a knife or any blade by using petroleum jelly. Get some of the jelly on your fingers and start applying it on all parts of the knife that have plastic on them. Make sure that you wear gloves during this so that your hands stay clean. Also make sure to go lightly along the edges as going too fast or hard will cut your fingers. Let the knife rest for some minutes after applying the jelly on it. Use a cloth to rub the jelly off of your knife after time has passed. Doing this will also make the pieces of plastic come off as well. It's also possible to use sandpaper during this step, as that will be more effective and give the knife a cleaner look. As you can see, doing this will completely clean your knife and get rid of the plastic from it. Finally, we have a large, cube-shaped iron piece that has some plastic melted on it. As you can see, the plastic will not budge with just our hands. That is why we will use a paper cutter to remove it effectively. Use the cutter to scrape around the area with melted plastic on it, so you can loosen its grip from the sides. Slowly make your way towards to the center of the piece, and it will eventually come off. Then, use the cutter to get rid of any extra pieces that are still stuck on the piece of iron. Doing this will help you get rid of a lot of the plastic but you can see that not all of it is gone. To deal with remaining debris, you can use sandpaper to rub off the melted plastic and give the iron a clean finish. It will be completely clean after this. Like you saw at the start of the video, the small pipe, knife, and iron piece had plastic pieces over them. But using these methods, we were able to get rid of all of it. Now they are completely clean and ready for use again. Hopefully, our methods to get rid of plastic from metal are able to help you out too. If they did, subscribe to Hooked on Tools so we can deliver more guides like this one to you.